Geometric vectors in Cartesian form. A ship is on a heading of 230 degrees at 80 knots. Write this velocity as a Cartesian vector. Now what does heading of 230 degrees at 80 knots mean? 230 degrees is the bearing angle. Now which is always seen from the north. So 230 degrees means this is 180. So 180 plus how much is 230? 180 plus 50, right? So it is kind of like this. So this angle is 230 degrees. So with the horizontal, it means how much? It means makes 40 degrees with the horizontal. Now when we say write this velocity as Cartesian vector, then what we really mean is that the magnitude of this component is 18 knots and it is at a bearing of 230 degrees, which is 80 plus 50, correct? With the horizontal, we have 40 degrees. Now, if we resolve this into its components along the horizontal and the vertical, what do we get? Those are the Cartesian vectors. So along the horizontal, we'll have 18 cos of 40 degrees, correct? So the Cartesian vector will be 18 cos of 40. Now since it is in the negative direction, we we'll write minus 18 cos of 40 degrees. We are taking acute angles, right? And for the y component, it is minus sine 18 of sine 40 degrees. So that is how we can get the Cartesian coordinate, right? So let's use the calculator and find the answer. So it's cos of 40 degrees times 18. That gives us 13.788 minus 13.79 we can see. And the y component is sine of 40 times 18 which is 11.57 both are negative as the ship is heading in the quadrant 3 right so in quadrant 3 both x and y coordinates will be negative so that is how you can translate or write a vector in Cartesian form thank you